Welcome back guys. Y'all remember in a previous video where I was telling you all that the Most High said that there will be double fold consequences and judgments taking place in the future. Well, we are at that time. We've been at that time for a minute. He is judging the church, which in scripture states that he will do so first and foremost. There are going to be many celebrities that are going to fall. Uh, one in particular that I uh, received in my spirit was Tiffany Montgomery, along with Jay-Z and Beyonce, which those have been heavy on my spirit for years now. Um, but these are just the ones that have been on my spirit. There's others, of course, uh, and many in the body of Christ, just like um, the gospel singers and so forth and then on the opposite end you have his children that have been obedient and haven't been stiff-necked and actually listening to the words that he gives to his prophets and you know things of that nature so just be aware that we are in that time make sure that you got your house in order make sure that you are paying attention to what he's trying to tell you or show you and stay focused on him at all times Ask him for guidance. Ask him to show you what you need to see and hear. It's such a pivotal moment in history and such a blessing to be alive in this time. But it also can be frightening to those that don't know him. But don't be afraid because his children he covers regardless. And if you are obedient and disciplined with him, you don't have anything to worry about. He covers us even when we're not. But in this season, he's tired and judgment is coming upon everyone. And depending on your heart posture, that is what you will receive as a consequence. Because, you know, consequences can be good and bad. But make sure your heart is in the proper posture because it's so imperative in this season. It is so imperative, guys. If you pay attention to what he's doing in the world, in the body, in the church, he is about to really uh, crack down on the church. And that P. Diddy list with all the gospel singers that were in trafficking or in cahoots with the trafficking ring and all that, that's just the beginning of the judgment on the church. He is tired. He wants a, an axe, the book of Acts. He wants an axe church. He wants a restored church. He wants a church that is for him, not a house that is just laden in sin and foolishness and taking him as a joke. He's tired, y'all. So I just wanted to share that because we're in that time. So make sure that you keep your heart in proper posture. Okay, guys? Peace and blessings.